I'm Jerry Morgan, CEO of Texas Roadhouse. For more than 20 years, Texas Roadhouse has been a proud partner of Special Olympics Kentucky. From the Armadillo Classic golf outing to the polar plunges and the truck pulls, it's an honor for Texas Roadhouse to play a role in giving Special Olympics athletes the opportunity to compete. And today, we're proud to help present the athletes, unified partners, and coaches who will make up Team Kentucky at the 2022 Special Olympics USA Games next June in Orlando, Florida. On behalf of everyone here at Texas Roadhouse, I want to wish you and all the athletes good luck. Now go down to my home state, the Sunshine State, and be legendary. Thank you, Jerry, for that awesome introduction. And thank you, Texas Roadhouse, for 20 plus years of legendary support to our program and athletes. We are very excited about the 2022 Special Olympics USA Games. These are gonna be the fifth USA Games, and there's gonna be roughly 4,500 athletes that will be participating. Soki is proud to be sending 34 athletes, seven unified partners, and 16 coaches to the games. Several of our friends and sponsors have joined us to help make this big announcement. So without further delay, let's meet Team Kentucky. Hi, I'm Bob Scorsellini, and I'm joined today by Jim Benassi, and we're representing the Louisville Italian American Association. Our organization is proud to have helped launch the Special Olympics Kentucky Bocce Program in 2008, and we're excited to have the chance to announce the Kentucky Bocce Delegation for the 2022 USA Games. Kentucky will send three athletes and a unified partner to Orlando next year. Amy Butler of Murray, Kimberly Dickmore of Murray, and Tori Thompson of Rockport are our three athletes. They will all compete in singles, and Amy and Kimberly will also compete as a doubles team. Tori will team with unified partner Mark McKinney of Beaver Dam to compete in the unified pairs event. Bud Kaufman of Hartford will coach the team for the second USA Games in a row. We are so proud of all these great competitors, and we wish them all the best in Orlando. Now, let's meet the Team Kentucky Bowlers. Hey everybody, I'm Craig Tiemens, Special Olympics Kentucky board member and member of Kentucky Wireless Association. And I'm Steve Nicely of the Kentucky Wireless Association. As the sponsor of the Special Olympics Kentucky Bowling Tournament that takes place right here at Kingpin Lanes, we're proud to announce the bowlers who compete as part of Team Kentucky. First, the ladies, Brianna Good of Glasgow and Casey Freeman of Franklin will each compete in singles and then will team up in the pairs event. And for the men, Dallas Derringer of Wood and Levi Oni of Olive Hill also compete in the singles before teaming up for the pairs competition and all four bowlers will compete together in the team event. The bowlers will be coached by the 2017 Special Olympics Coach of the Year, Michael Gant from Frankfurt, so they know will be in good hands. Good luck to all the bowlers. Now let's meet the Team Kentucky Flag Football Team. Hi everyone, I'm Mike Johnson. I'm the Athletic Director at Marshall County High School. Joining me today is Head Football Coach for the Marshalls, Steve the Bull Etheridge. Special Olympics is a huge part of the community in Marshall County and we're excited that they will represent Team Kentucky in the USA Games this year. Coach Etheridge will introduce the players that will be representing Team Kentucky. All right, those great players representing us. We have brothers Aaron Hunter and Ryan Morrison from Dexter. We have James Davio of Calvert City. We have Chris Capone of Benton. We have Travis Hicks from Gilbertsville. Edward Burkeen of Benton. Jacob Dunn from Dexter. And Haley Bird from Hardin. Coaches leading the team, USA, is Randy Dunn from Dexter and Johnny Bird from Hardin. We're super excited and proud of these athletes because they are the first team from Marshall County to represent Team Kentucky in the games. 
Hi, I'm William Rover, General Manager of Jersey Mike's in Lexington. We're proud to partner with Special Olympics Kentucky for our month of giving every March, and I am extremely excited that Jersey Mike's is the presenting sponsor of the 2022 Special Olympics USA Games. It is an honor to get to introduce the golfers who will be representing the state as part of Team Kentucky. Kentucky will be sending two unified pairs to compete in Orlando. Each pair includes a Special Olympics athlete and a partner without an intellectual disability who train and compete as a team. First up, brothers Brian Chile and his unified partner Kevin Chile of Glasgow will be competing in the nine hole alternate shot event. This is the first trip to the USA Games for both of them. Our other pair is Wake Mullins and unified partner Dennis Gaines of Lexington who will be competing in the 18 hole alternate shot event. Wake and Dennis claimed a bronze medal in the event in 2018, Games in Seattle. During that competition, Dennis carted his first ever hole in one. The golfers will be coached by Special Olympics Kentucky individual sports director, Nick McKenzie of Lexington. Nick will make his first trip to the USA Games. Good luck to these four great golfers. Next, we will meet Team Kentucky gymnasts. Hello, I'm a former University of Kentucky gymnast and Soki intern, Megan Monfredi. One of the highlights of my UK gymnastics career was getting to volunteer at the Special Olympics State Artistic Gymnastics Competition, and I'm excited to have the opportunity to announce the three gymnasts who will represent Team Kentucky at the USA Games. First, the most decorated athlete in Special Olympics Kentucky history, Lee Dawkins of Russellville, will be competing in her fourth USA Games. Lexington's Aaliyah White will make her second consecutive trip to the USA Games after winning four medals in 2018. And Rachel Connor of Versailles will be making her first trip to the USA Games. Team Kentucky will once again be coached by Lexington's Mary Farrenbaugh, who has headed the team at all five games. I know they, these three will continue the great tradition of Kentucky gymnasts at the USA Games, and I can't wait to follow along. Next, let's meet Team Kentucky swimmers. Hi everybody, it's 2020 Olympic silver medalist Brooke Forty. Before realizing my dream of winning a medal at the Olympics, I got to volunteer at Special Olympic swim meets here in Louisville. And so it's my great pleasure to get to announce the four swimmers from Kentucky who get to chase their dreams at next year's USA Games. First, making her USA Games debut is Union's Maddie Brinkman. Lexington's Megan McCormick will be making her third trip to USA Games after meddling in 2010 and 2018. Justin Hale of Crestwood returns to USA Games after winning a gold and silver medal at the 2018 Games in Seattle. And finally, from right here in Louisville, is USA Games first-timer Austin Stein. Team Kentucky will be coached for the second USA Games in a row by Debbie Ogden of Fort Wright, who coaches the Northern Kentucky Dolphins program. I'm so excited for all of you as you prepare for this great experience, so swim fast and go for the gold. Now we'll meet the track and field team. Hi everybody, I'm Joe Settles of Kentucky's Touchstone Energy Cooperatives. As the platinum sponsor of the state summer games, I've had the great honor of being here at Eastern Kentucky University's track watching Special Olympics Kentucky athletes doing their best and helping present them their awards. And on behalf of the Kentucky's Touchstone Energy member cooperatives, I'm honored to announce the Team Kentucky Track and Field Delegation. First from Hallsville, we have Kevin Rates. Next up is Trevor Yates from Shepherdsville. From Louisville, we have Michaela Hickerson. Finally, the only USA Games veteran on the team is Caitlin Roy of Finchville. Caitlin won two medals at the 2018 Games in Seattle, including gold in the 200 meters. Team Kentucky will be coached by Murray's Laura Miller, who will be making her third trip to the USA Games. Good luck to all the athletes. Make sure you bring the energy. We will all be cheering for you. Thank you, Joe, and thank you everyone who participated in this announcement. I'm Kim Siderwhite, Vice President of Field and Athlete Services at Special Olympics Kentucky, and I want to recognize just a few more people who will be part of Team Kentucky effort as support staff at the Games. I am honored to be serving as a head of delegation for Team Kentucky for the third consecutive Games. It will be my fifth trip to the USA Games. Hunter Brislin, Director of Sports and Competitions, will serve as the Assistant Head of Delegation in Orlando. This is his second USA Games after working as a sports staff at the 2018 Games in Seattle. Jeff Corder of Bowling Green will once again serve as our medical support. Jeff has been a volunteer for more than 30 years with Special Olympics Kentucky Events Medical Team that provides first aid for all of our state competitions. This will be his fourth USA Games taking care of our athletes and staff. 
Mark Berger, Special Olympics Communications Director, will be making his fifth trip to the USA Games to handle the PR for Team Kentucky. And Kelly Farquhar will serve as her first USA Games experience in Orlando. She is our Volunteer Services Manager at Soki. She will be handling family for Team Kentucky, among other responsibilities. We actually have some additional team additions to King Kentucky in the coming weeks. Kentucky will be sending a unified collegiate level basketball team to Orlando as well as a unified youth leadership pair. I encourage you to visit SOKY.org to learn more about everyone who will be part of Team Kentucky and I hope you will follow along there on all of our social media channels to keep up the progress. Go Team Kentucky! Go Team Kentucky! Go Team Kentucky! Go Team Kentucky! From everybody at Jersey Mike's, good luck and go Team Kentucky! 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 Go team Kentucky.